Hi everyone, I'm Stuart from the Norfolk Honey Company and welcome back to my beekeeping channel, the Norfolk Honey Company. Uh, this video is actually uh, a vlog video that I recorded while I was at the BBKA Spring Convention, so that's the British Beekeeping Association Spring Convention, which is a gathering of beekeepers uh, for uh, not only lectures and uh, conversation, but also for a trade show, practical workshops, and a whole multitude of, of other events. And uh, it's part of the vlog series that I'm currently posting to my Patreon page for everyone that's supporting me there. And I just thought it would be quite nice to post that to my YouTube channel, just so that you can get a view of uh, how the vlog looks and what we're doing and what we're recording with that. So if you're not familiar with our Patreon page, it's where you can support me in creating lots more content, and not just the videos, but also a podcast, a blog that goes out on our website, but also a Google Plus private group and also a video conference call that we host every couple of weeks or so. And by signing up to one of the reward tiers, you can access uh, some of that additional content. And you can sign up for as little as $1 per month. And uh, I recently took a look on the internet to see what you could get for $1. And it looks as if you could probably get a cheap cup of coffee from one of those burger restaurants. Uh, you could get an iTunes download. I'm sure there's lots of other things that you can get for a dollar, but I think the upshot is that for $1 a month, you can gain access to at least 12 videos, my entire back catalog, and also access directly to me through the Patreon page messaging system. So if that's of interest to you and you'd like to support us producing more of these videos, then please do take a look at our Patreon page, which is www.patreon.com forward slash Norfolk Honey. So here's the vlog, I hope you enjoy it, and if you'd like to see more of the vlog, then again, take a look at our Patreon page where you can catch up with all of the previous episodes. Morning everyone, uh, Stuart here, and it's a almost sunny morning here in Telford. I'm heading over to the British Beekeeping Association Spring Convention where I'm hoping to uh, not only bag a few bargains, but I'm also going to try and interview a few people for my podcast. And uh, one of those will be Belinda Bright from BB Wear, but we're also hoping to chat to uh, Dan from BS Honey, who supplied me with the two-in-one nukes that I did a review on not so long ago. Uh, so it should be quite a good day. Uh, hopefully try and find some time to shoot more video as we go through and uh, I have to say I'm feeling a little bit anxious about it I whenever I do an interview it's not something that I do very often but whenever I interview people in fact it's just the one at the moment um, I get that kind of performance <laughs> nerves I get a bit of a knotted tummy and um, hope that I don't make a fool of myself. So um, wish me luck and I will catch up with you later in the day. Well, I managed a very easy trip over to the Harper Adams University, which is in a beautiful part of the country. And I'm now stuck in the car park and hopefully going to unload all of the wax for the wax exchange. And that's where I take all of the accumulated wax that I've had over the past year over to one of the main suppliers of wax, probably Maysmore Apiaries, Thorns are here as well with their wax exchange, and uh, we swap it over for a fresh foundation that we can then use to replenish our beehives. So uh, I might see if I can get somebody to take the odd photograph while I'm over there, um, but I'm, I won't video single-handed and try and capture all of that, so um, we'll catch up in a few minutes. So I'm just back from my first trip to the trade show and bought a few bits and pieces. We've done the wax exchange, got lots of wax and I bought some brood frames for my commercial beehives and also uh, a new smoker, a new honey gate for one of my settling tanks, which I'll uh, give you a look at when I get back and get a chance to open everything up. I uh, had some nice conversations with a few people. It's been rather tricky trying to do a video 
in the hall, but I might take the camera back and just have a walk around and just record some video, perhaps from the corner of the hall, so you can get a feel for uh, the size of the show. So I'll just come back to the truck to get a drink and have a bite to eat, and then I'm going to go back in and do some more shopping and looking around and see what's new, and then uh, we'll set up the interviews that we need to do and that should hopefully see us done for the day then and I can get back uh, to the hotel and have a look at all the bits and pieces I've bought. So these are the crows that keep making all the noise. So this is where we have our wax exchange. That's the Maysmore truck. And that's, uh, those are the guys that I got my wax exchange sorted with today. And you basically take the wax over to them and they'll do a swap. And then beside them, over here we've got thorns. And thorns also do wax exchange, but they'll also bring in their pre-orders as well. So here's the grand entrance to the BBKA Spring Convention. It's always good fun. It always gets quite busy as well. One of the things you do have to do is to show your wristband. So we'll show them our wristband. Um, just have a wander around, do a bit of video to show everybody, those people that can't make it. And especially people who are not in this country. There's, I get quite a lot of inquiries from people who say, yeah. Well, we don't have trade shows like that yeah, in yeah, the States yeah. or whatever, so it's yeah. quite nice to just, yeah. just show people, really. Yeah. Yeah. So, right, we'll wander on. Yeah, on. yeah, cheers. So here we've got Alan on the Brunel microscope stand with a fantastic display of his microscopes for beekeepers. And if it's books you're after, then really you need go no further than Northern Bee Books. An enormous selection of beekeeping books of all sorts.
drugs were out. We didn't have any. And thorns always have a huge stand. So this is a really important part of the BBKA Spring Convention and this is all uh, not-for-profit organisations. So lots of people like the Biber organisation, Bees Abroad, uh, International Bee Research Association. So people that do a, a lot of really good work for beekeepers around the world. Well, I've been around the trade show and it's been really interesting. I've met some old friends and spoken to some of the suppliers who are also old friends. And it's been really nice to catch up with people there's some great products out there. Uh, again, I've already produced a video about the BS Honey 2-in-1 Nuke, but we had a chat with Dan and managed to interview him, and that was, that, that was quite nice. Bless him, he seemed a bit nervous, but we'll see how the interview comes out on the podcast. Belinda at BB Wear was fantastic. It was great to chat to her, and it's always nice to talk to the team at BB Wear. And also, we got a chance to have some time with Brunel Microscopes who are again lovely people Alan and Helen who were on the stand and hopefully we'll be able to get some more kit to show you and to do some more microscopy videos uh, probably not through the summer but certainly into the autumn and winter of this year I can't believe I'm already thinking about producing videos for the autumn and winter but it's now late in the afternoon and everything's shutting down so I'm going to head back to my hotel room and review my recordings for the day and also have a look at some of the stuff that I've bought which is always quite exciting and we'll catch up next time. I can thoroughly recommend a trip to the BBKA Spring Convention. Lots of talks, lots of stands, especially through the trade show, lots of really good kit on display and you could spend a fortune so be warned but uh, if you haven't ever come across to it, then I recommend it. And I'm now going to go back and have a well-earned drink. I'll catch